NASCAR Race Hub. I'm Caitlin Vinci alongside Michael Waltrip, David Reagan, two of my favorite guys with me for the next half hour. We got a great show on tap for you. It's bigger in Texas, as they say. It's a brand new round. 12 teams made it on to the right 12 advance. What do you think, Michael? I'm a double hubber. I did a what? This, a double hubber. I did hubber. the show last night. Hubber. Okay. Double, <laughs> d d double hub. Double I, hopefully, hub. Michael says something good for tonight. You, you didn't trying to figure out if, how I'm dealing with Joey Logano not being mm. you know, a part of the championship chase, but uh, how's your bracket look? Yeah, I did have Joey going a little further, and remember, Caitlin, just last year, two walk-off wins That's right. at the row one at Martinsville to make it to the Final Four. He's playoff ready, a lot of energy, and a lot of speed right now. Okay, so keep an eye on Kyle Busch and Christopher Bell as we approach this next round. So what are the drivers in for when it comes to the round of 12 tracks that are coming up? There's a big variety amongst the three. Here are the drivers. Weigh in. Is it to leave there with a good finish? Well, it's the only one of these races where you're going to truly be able to control your own destiny. You know, you get to Talladega, it's pack race. You can go to the Roval, you saw the spin. Smiling. That one's that corner's flat. What are we going to do about that? Really fun racetrack and a lot of energy when you go to, to Texas for NASCAR. Yeah, these drivers have to be aggressive. Get Chris Busher into the postseason, and how does he feel his playoffs may go? Here's the Busher playoff five. That's good. <laughs> That's but true. eight in the morning, head to the big house, feel all the energy, just cheering on her. her team and seeing the smile on her face when they got the W. I, I'm really happy about college football. Yeah, you just can't beat some college football. And a big part of the college football game is the energy and presence of the mascots. So in the spirit of the new season, we had the drivers weigh in on college football mascots. And one driver's response, it may surprise As fast as he wanted to be. But, I, you know, I'd love to see him get something done in these fi final seven races. All right. Well, moments from Kevin Harvick's career, we've been looking at him. So today we look back at his win from Texas back in 2019 that tied him to all-time wins with Tony Stewart. Started. I thought that was that game where you throw those wooden Hibachi balls ball. down the court. The, Incorrect. The hibachi, hibachi ball. Hibachi yeah, hibachi I, yeah. Ball. I didn't know they were going to be eating rice. That's pretty I, I, awesome. I think uh, we were more of a ham sandwich kind of guy. What did what, you eat for pre-race? I just love the cheeseburger. Oh, a good old cheeseburger. cheeseburger. Yeah. Okay. There you go. Yeah, you got to have some protein. Meals yeah. the champions. But, but I can't wait to listen it. to what Adam and uh, I look to forward say. to that as well. Guys, it's been a fun week here on The Hub. Let's relive some of the moments. It is our